Many of us have dilemmas with our charging cords where the outer sheathing uh, comes off and the inner wires are exposed from flex and it's just, just hanging by a thread, but we keep using them anyway and they stop working because the wire inside just gets compromised and uh, metal fatigued and breaks inside. Uh, this happened to me and I figured, let me give it a try to fix it. Uh, on another cord, I used heat shrinkable tubing, but you, you can't get it really over here properly. You have to use a larger size of heat shrink tubing, and where it gets to where it needs to be to do the most good, it, it's too big. So I end up cutting smaller pieces and shoving it under there to take up the space. And it was tedious and time it was tedious and time consuming and worked okay, but maybe there's a better way. And I had another cord, which is the same thing. So I cut a piece of uh, drinking straw and slid it down the middle, and I put that over it. Uh, I put hot glue over the uh, affected area and the rest of the sheathing down, and I slid the, the straw over, and I actually uh, pumped hot glue uh, in the back end because that was kind of open, and it you know, worked pretty good, and I did it on the other side, and, and it's plenty strong. It is, uh, but it looks like maybe, maybe if I could just omit the straw, how would that work? So I took another cord, which is perfectly fine, and as a preemptive test measure, I just, you know, laid laid beads along the side, running that way and turned it and that way, and you know, I turned it and and this works good. It looks real good, and it's a lot less hassle. It looks acceptable, you know, looks fine for me. I mean, it works. It's protected. The cord will last a lot longer. Uh, you know, and if you get your hot glue aficionado and you got the gun, hey. Works pretty good. So, uh, you know, you just do something like this. Come on, baby. Give it a spin. Oh, man, this is a little awkward. The camera in front of me, but you get the picture. And you go all the way around and... You know, if you miss a, if you miss a spot or you want to do half of it and you know do strips and leave a space in between and go back and do it again, that works fine too. As all of us who have hot glue guns know. Uh, yeah, like I said, this is a little messy, but you could do a better job without a camera in front of you. Works good. It's quick, and it'll save your cords. Give it a try.